Hello everyone, this is VJLZ32, back again, it's time for another deck review. Actually, it's better than a deck review. It is an update on my deck links, and I know you want to see it. This is a all the decks that I have gotten since the deck collection video I did back in October, about a month ago. And there's a lot, and you're going to be dropping some jaws, I think. <laughs> and... Yeah, and I'm going to do this probably every month or so, update you on what I've gotten before I kind of put it all away, so that you can see what I'm getting. This is not to try and make you jealous or anything like that. I wanted to do it before, but I decided against it, but now I'm going to do it. I figured, you know, you can watch my unboxing videos every week and see what I'm getting, but there's not always this decks in that, and I don't always keep all of those decks because one reason or another. <laughs> But anyways, let's get right on to it. Ta -da. There is a lot. This was just in about one month. Let's start over here. First of all, I got... Bicycle Tall Stacks. 95, that was from a trade. Grateful Dead deck. I'm not sure if that was in the last video or not. A couple of tobacco decks. Expert A, Premium, and Advantage. The Gypsy deck. My own deck. The VJ deck. Two of those I'm keeping for sure. Uh, these are some that I missed in the last video. These are from the Trilby deck. One is like a stripper. One is like color changing. Then there's the Bay card. In three different colors. These ones are better than this one. Intense Bridge, which is an interesting deck that has not only decks, queens, and kings, but also jills. There's the Bicycle Prestige, two deck set. Lose World, the Lufthansa Airline playing cards that I just got for free in a trade. There's thrown in there. Hoyle Stripes and Hoyle Dots. Tally Holes, Pink, Circle Back, Black, Fan Back, Black. Circle back because these are all kind of harder to find. Green circle back, really hard to find. The bicycle color collection uh, with nine decks in different colors. There's turquoise, fuchsia, gold, silver, black, red, blue, orange, and green. A second bicycle gargles, an abisco thing, which is pretty cool. Some of the Vict playing cards. One open, the other one's open, but it's signed by somebody. <laughs> Seep's Head, official playing cards, more game than anything. A second curator deck, a CMYK playing cards, one is open, one is sealed. They're pretty interesting. This is The Code by Andy Neiman, it's a marked deck. This is a manipulation deck from Illusionist, or sorry, from 311 that I reviewed recently. A Dan Spiry thing. Uh, we got these Outlaws of the Mars playing cards. Kind of interesting. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them or not. One is open, one is sealed. Brown Rounders, one open, one sealed. Blue Rounders, one open, one sealed. A couple of bridge decks here from uh, Egg Mueller AGM, which is apparently owned by Carter Munde. A Black Standard. Pretty cool. A red Heineken, even though it's missing a couple of cards, nice and vintage and cool. The Exquisite from DeVoe, I got one open, one sealed. Red Monarchs, one open, one sealed. Jerry's Nuggets, the real deal. Red Arcanes. A couple of standards, these ones are special editions from Walmart, look like that. The Red Tunes, one open, one sealed. Angel Plane Cards, bam. Marlboro Texan set with two decks of the star deck. They're pretty awesome. This is a vintage Magic Castle deck. You got the Ann Stokes collection, the original one, and also the Dark Hearts. We got the Synthesis in red and blue. Ace Authentic in black and green. The Braille playing cards. White Rabbit, one of those. Low Visions from Carter Munde, red and blue. Uh, some vintage Hornet decks. 
Gold Arcane, a second one of those. This is the Bicycle Boss from Draw Like a Boss on Kickstarter. One open, one sealed. A second Bicycle Revision. A second, I think it's a second or third, I don't even know. Fulton's Chinatown deck. Feral Plane Cards, one open, one sealed from Collectible Plane Cards. I got some Diamond Jim Tyler decks here. Blue and red, two of each, one open, one sealed. Not sure if I'm going to keep these two yet, but we'll see. A second white altruism, Snow Owls. Two of the amazing deck, one open, one sealed. Two of the original Jack Sellers decks, one open, one sealed. And this one doesn't even have a seal on it. Pretty interesting. Not sure if it means it's older or newer. There is one lefty deck in blue. Figured why not. A Pepsi deck, nice and pretty cool. And then there is a matching Coca-Cola deck. There is another Coca-Cola deck. Gypsy Witch fortune telling cards. A second rare bit. A second elephant tsunami deck. This one with the red seal. The one I had before is a blue seal. Whispering Imps. Uh, the standard one in black. One open. One sealed. And one sealed limited edition red box. Somebody was asking me. I uh, was wondering why I didn't open this one because I always open all my decks, but I try not to if it's the same damn thing, which it is, just the box is different. Uh, Luxury Crowns, the limited edition ones with the metal plaque, red and blue. Uh, the blue one's still sealed. The red one is opened. Yeah. And um, apparently there's white ones coming, if you can believe that. And I'm can't recall if I had these in my last collection video or not. If I did, my apologies. I got Fournier 818s in red, blue, green, and orange. A second Skull Core, a second White Oracle, a second First Edition Blue Artifice. Uh, there's a few in here that are trades or donations, I guess, if you will. Uh, there is a Bicycle Everyday Zombies, a Bicycle Favol, the Bicycle Amber Stave, one open, one sealed. Make it a Jack Cocktail playing cards, Jack Daniels. A couple more studs, the older ones and the newer ones, red and blue, red and blue. Because I only had one of each, so I figured might as well get a couple more, or one more of each at least. Because they are not going to be around for much longer, I don't think. A couple of Jamako gem backs, uh, one red, one blue. These are Jamako decks without logos on them. Uh, I got this Sam the Olympic Eagle deck, mini deck. I'll probably get a bridge or poker size one soon. I got the collector set, although I'm not actually keeping the decks, just a box. <laughs> Go figure. I got a bunch of decks here that I still got to review, including a mini coke deck. So I got a trade. This is the Magic Cartoon deck, which I just got. Bicycle Card Ninja, Bicycle Dirty, 30 for 30, Distinct Life. The Trickster Company playing cards, Tlingit Language Edition. I'm trying to see if I can get the, the other one I'm supposed to have, which is a standard deck. Bicycle Deco in bronze and silver from Encarded. Awesome. And I got two more coming, one of each coming still. A Bicycle Platinum, I also got another one of those coming. Bicycle 8-bit traditional decks in red and blue. I got down here uh, Chaos. And this one is the OCD deck, which I'll probably perform soon. I got that straight jacket. That's pretty cool. And then I got this, a red Olympic deck. Awesome. Really wanted one of those. Uh, second Ice Breaker deck from uh, Ferguson. Rich Ferguson. Although it's open, a couple of the heads, bicycle cards, one open, one seal. World Series of Poker with that back design, one red, one black. A couple of purple florals, one open, one seal, and I got green ones on the way. A couple of bridge size B decks, a 575 Espanol deck made in Israel, apparently. Pretty interesting. And then a second Steampunk Cthulhu, and this one is signed by uh, Nat Iwata. And then I got the Elves and Orcs decks, one open, one sealed. This one is signed by Nat Iwata. They're actually open, 
for signing purposes, but he put the cellophane back on, which is pretty awesome. And a Carnival Delirium. I do have one more, but I don't think I'll keep it. I usually keep just one of every Carnival deck. Anyways, that's what I got this month. That is a lot. I mean, we got Blue Rounders, Gold Arcanes, Red Arcanes, Nuggets, and all sorts of other cool, awesome stuff, vintage stuff, green circle bags, the color collection, you name it. I got it my own deck, which you can still get at my Etsy, Etsy.com store, which is the card club. Just search Vito's Day 32 on Etsy.com and you'll find it. I might do a Black Friday or Cyber Monday sale, we'll see. And that's that. See you next time.